Welcome to my channel. My name is Mina Bodhi. So, um, I did upload my last video was about my Christmas decor, putting up my first Christmas decor up. And so today I want to put up my second Christmas decor, which is this wig. So I'm gonna take you along with me. I just want to transform this wig and um, see if I can make it look prettier. I'm just fluffing this. Um, this wig and making it look bigger that's that's what i'm doing and i'll see if i can add any any um any more decor to it so we will do this together um i just want to thank you all for the support the love has been massive guys if this is your first time of coming to this channel you're highly welcome and then please don't forget to subscribe and join this family and let's build this channel together so i'm going to make it look it's do you know what with this rate you don't need to add anything more if you don't want to you really do not need to if you don't want to because it's pretty on its own as it is it's pretty on its own I will see if I can add anything if I choose to, but um, I don't know. Sometimes we 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 spend so much, and I'm learning not to be too um, extravagant. Or to spend unnecessarily when it comes to Christmas. So what I do, what I've been doing is to ensure that if I'm buying a Christmas decor, I make sure that Christmas decor I'm buying will last me a lifetime, <laughs> if it's possible, you know. And we're still in November, yeah. And somebody will be wondering why is she putting up her Christmas decor in November, and not wait till December. Hello, the shops have already started selling um, goods for. Christmas and um, People have started preparing for Christmas and I'm like, why do I have to wait till December before I I mount up my Christmas decor and you know how um, How Tedious and tasking putting up your Christmas decor is and then I'll go through all of that and then leave it for just um, one month and then take it off at the beginning of the new year in the first week of January I don't think it's um, I've, all the hard work I've put in should be just for one month no I don't think so so I'm starting early this year to give me that uplift and give me that Christmassy spirit so I don't know what you guys think about this let's see if I need to add any more or I will add and see what it looks like. I will add and see what it looks like, and then I will judge before I display it on my on my entrance, my entrance door, my front, my front door. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But I'll be okay I move on each and every day The past is where it stays Way back a year ago I've changed for the better this time I thought I would never be fine I strive just to say I'm alright And for the first time in a long time Okay, so friends, this is um, how much I've been able to do here. I don't know if I've done a good job or it's too um, clumsy. I don't know, but I think I have done with it. I just need to hang it and see what it looks like. Let's see. Let's assume this is my door. Ooh. 
Okay. What do you guys think? I am going to hang this on the door. And then let's see. Good morning and welcome to my channel. I am ready for church today. Although I'm, I'm not feeling the best. I'm not 100%. You can see my medication there. But I just need to go and see if I can feel better in church. So I'm wearing yellow because I want my complexion, my countenance today to be hyped and lovely. I will see you guys when I get back from church. I I started um, is it let my hair behind so I will show it to you guys when I come back. My kitchen is such a mess. We went out last night and we've not done anything. So uh, when I get back from church I will show you the progress I have made with my hair. I'm trying to put my hair plate my hair I call it plating myself, so I'll show it to you guys. Um, if this is I am um, today is Sunday, and you guys know that on Sunday I go to church every Sunday. I go to church if I am able to, you know. And so far, God has been helping me. So um, I have a medication. I've been prescribed some medication, and I want to do that now. Cake. So I'm just taking my tablet, so I need to eat this cake, and then I'll take tea. I'll go to church. So. How often do you? I just want to ask this question. Especially if you're a believer. Is it every Sunday morning that you really fill up to it? As in you want to go to church. You look forward to. I mean, as a believer, we all should be looking forward to going to church, right? But sometimes life gets in the way and you really, really don't even want to leave your space to go and be with. And, and mingle and mix with other people. Like the scripture says. We should not forsake the assembly of brethren. So, what are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? To, to me, today feels like one of those days, but we keep pushing, believing God. Because there are days you don't feel like going to work, but you still go to work because there are bills to be paid. Why is it different from church? People get you angry at church and you stay away from church. But you go to work, people don't get you angry at work every day and you still go to work. It's not balance, is it? <laughs> like my people would say, life no balance. But I think we need to pray more for patience to be more accommodating to everybody so that we don't lose our own salvation. We don't lose our own peace of mind. It's just for you and you alone, not for the other party. And then um, we ask for help from the Holy Spirit so that we can still stay in line and live out the purpose of God for our lives. But sometimes you feel like that. You don't work with the best people. But you still go to church. I'm sorry, you still go to work. Your bills are getting paid. But in church, people will step on your toes. Yes, they will say things that will get you angry. Yes, and then you stop going to church. It has happened and it is still happening. But we need to be careful, every one of us. We all need to be careful not to be the reason why people stop coming to church. 
And we need to be careful as well that we don't stop coming to church because of what people have said. And we need to ask for the help of the Holy Spirit. And um, yeah, that's it. Even in your family, people say things you don't like in the family you come from, the people you live with in the same space. Do you get up and pack your bags and say, not a chance, never again. I'm not living here again with you guys. I'm not family anymore. We don't do that. But we trample on church. <laughs> it's so easy for us to do that. So um, I'm back from church and I, I assembled this yesterday. I don't know. I think it's okay. I don't know if I should take off some or not. But I'm going to hang it on this door with um, with this so I would not need to drill any hole this was what I did last year and it's still here let me see this was the one for last year so I'm just going to do it and put it across like this Ooh. guys that's the christmas wreath out there i don't know what you guys think please let me know in the comment section if i should take off all these bubbles or not but i think i'm okay i just need to hide this a little bit that's all yeah thank you i have um, put up my second christmas decor for 2024 which is the wreath that i did uh Tell me what you think guys in the comment section. I added a few extra to that wreath to give it a new look, a different look from the look we had last year for Christmas and I've, you saw me mount it up on my, on my door and um, I didn't have to drill, put a hole in my door. I used, um, is it, I can't remember the name of that, is it blue tack? blue tack i think but i'll leave the name on the screen if i remember while i'm editing this film and so if you guys have um watched up until this very moment thank you so much for being here to my heartbeat the heartbeat of this channel my returning subscribers thank you guys i appreciate all of you and if you are yet to become a heartbeat please do so by subscribing to my channel and i promise you you're not gonna regret joining this channel so yeah so i still have um, a few other things i need to do for my christmas decor but i'm taking it one step at a time this morning before i went to church i started this on my hair and i'm i'm done with it now so until the next time i see you in my next video it's a wrap for me on this video bye and stay blessed remember i love you with the love of christ Thank you for being here. Thank you for being part of this journey. And I'm praying that this week that we have begun will give us a new, you know, our new expectations, our new blessings and new favor will locate every one of us. In this season of Christmas, let there be love in our midst in the name of Jesus. So until I see you again in my next video. Mm -hmm. Our hearts beat to the city streets, we begin to feel the fire.